The word for today, the one thing. Here are two enemies that threaten your spiritual life. One, boredom. Missionary and educator Frank Lorbach said, if you're weary of some sleepy form of devotion, probably God is as weary of it as you are. Walking with God is the most rewarding life possible. In your presence is fullness of joy. At your right hand are pleasures forevermore. Two, busyness. Jesus told Martha, you are worried and upset over all these details. There is only one thing worth being concerned about. Mary has discovered it. And what was Mary doing? Sitting at Jesus' feet, listening to him. Martha loved Jesus and she couldn't do enough for him. But she was so busy serving him that she didn't know how to relax and enjoy being with him. Maybe like Martha, you think that unless you do the job yourself, it won't get done properly. And you may be right, but God will never ask you to do anything that takes his place in your life. God wants to be your top priority. Sometimes we approach God with a list of requests the length of our arm because we're more interested in his presence than his presence. David said, The one thing I ask of the Lord, the thing I seek most, is to live in the house of the Lord all the days of my life, delighting in the Lord's perfections and meditating in his temple. Can you imagine having one thing at the top of your agenda at all times, needing and desiring to spend time with God? Think how that could revolutionize your life.